So when it comes to the rain, does it rain here all the time? Well, sorry for the interruption for my chickens here. <laughs> yes, it does rain a lot here, but that's what creates all of our greenery, all of our beauty. And as you can see, this is the gear that we wear. We've got extra tufts and shorts and mediums and talls and mud boots, rain jackets and rain pants. What you don't see is umbrellas. That's how you can kind of spot an out-of-towner as if they have an umbrella. I don't own an umbrella, I just own rain gear. So yes, it does rain and it does flood. It's Andrea Benson. I am a local realtor down here in Southwest Washington State, and I'm with Wakaikum Realty. And I absolutely love getting phone calls from people that watch these videos and want to reach out to me. I am a real person and I would love to meet you. I would love to talk with you. So give me a call, send me a text, send me an email, um, and I would love to help you out. I get people all the time that say they watched my videos and that's what helped them move here, but they didn't call me. So make sure you give me a call and I would love to help you. Yes, it does rain here and it rains here a lot, uh, especially in the fall, winter, spring, but that's what gives everything the greenery, the beauty around here. And yes, it does flood. And that is one major reason why you should call me the local realtor to this area because I am aware of all of the flooding around here. I've driven around it, I know about it, I've seen pictures, drone footage, so I know which properties flood and which properties don't. And if you get an out of town realtor, they will not know that information as well as me. So give me a call. But yes, it does rain here. True people from around here, this is what I wear. I've got the shorts, I've got the mediums, I've got the talls, I've got the mud boots, the rain jackets, the rain pants. What I don't have is an umbrella. And that's kind of how you can tell out of towners is they may have an umbrella. We don't have umbrellas here, we just have loads of rain gear. Uh, I am obviously a supporter of Extra Tough, so that's a lot of my shoes and gear and I wear them all the time. And that's just kind of what we do here. So yes, it rains, yes, it floods, um, but it's not as, I don't think it's as bad as people imagine sometimes in their heads. Today obviously is a nice, beautiful day and it actually snowed this morning. Today is February 23rd, 2022. And we actually have some leftover snow in our yard. Chicken's kind of pecking at it. They usually hate the snow. I had to shovel them a uh, chicken snow path last time it snowed several inches here. So yes, it does snow here on average. You know, we get maybe a couple inches or so each winter. This winter we got a little extra. It's kind of been actually a, a really wet winter we've got. I think record rainfall we had in November this year. So we had quite a bit of flooding here in the valley, the Grays River Valley, especially. We've got a lot of rivers that are tidal based around here. So you get those right king tides, the full moons, lots of rain, and that equals lots of flooding around here. So, you know, like I said, we do get snow. The beach even gets snow every now and then. They got snow this year. I believe they got snow last year. It doesn't stick around for very long though. Um, this year, I think here at our house, we, I think got about 14 inches. The, it was like the day after Christmas this year. So that would have been 2021. And it lasted a few days. Um, you know, sometimes we get like the ice rain around here, but what I love about here is we don't have the extremes. You know, I've lived in North Idaho. I've shoveled lots of snow. I've lived down in Texas and I've got heat exhaustion down there working outside. And so, you know, I love it here because we don't have the extremes. Yes, we might get some snow, doesn't last long. We don't have a shovel. I've never bought a shovel here. And in the summertime, you know, we had a pretty hot summer last summer. I think everywhere did here in the Pacific Northwest. I know Portland, Seattle, they all hit uh, record highs. You know, we had record highs here. So that was kind of an unusual hot summer. 
but normally we typically range, you know, 80s in the summertime. And the beauty about, you know, getting all this rain here is that it stays, you know, stuff stays here green all summer long. Yeah, some of the, you know, bushes and stuff might turn a little brown, but for the most part, you know, all of our trees and most of the bushes, the grass, you know, we don't have any sprinklers in our in our grass, but it stays, you know, relatively green all year round. So that's the benefit of, you know, the rain. But like I said, the, the major thing that you need to be concerned about, especially in Waukiakum County, is the flooding. So if you are thinking about moving here, give me a call, send me a text, shoot me an email. Cool thing is, is it's kind of like you already know who I am. So if we are a good fit, I'd love to hear from you. I'm a real person and I love to hear people that see my videos. So make sure you reach out because it's super important to have a local realtor here that knows about the areas and flooding and water tables because that also affects your septic because high water tables, wetland delineation, that all determines, you know, where you can build, where you can put a septic system. And that is information that local realtors like me know. So give me a call. I'd love to hear from you. And until next time, take care.